and they created fiat money. Fiat is just a fancy word for fake. It's fake money. All of the money in the United States is fake. And it's backed up not by gold anymore. It's backed up by war. It's backed up by oil. It's backed up by political power, military, and all of these things that are designed to keep the U.S. in a dominant position, right? But these other countries are fed up. And especially these other countries who are really big, right? India, so one of the biggest populations in the world, a lot of innovation, a lot of coders and technology and really smart people coming out of India, right? Russia, one of the biggest countries in the world. China, one of the biggest countries in the world. Brazil, one of the biggest countries in the world. Huge populations and masses of people who they're tired of being second-class citizens on the world stage. They're tired of not being considered in NATO. They're tired of having economic forces put on them. And so now they're fighting back and they're all fighting back simultaneously, right? So even if Trump was in office or even if Obama or Bush or whoever you want to put, I don't know how any president would be able to react to simultaneously multiple nations announcing that they're getting off of the gold standard, right? When this has happened in the past, it has happened in the past. The U.S. has stepped in and done everything in their power to prevent it.